Good morning. My name is Roberto Vessani, and I'm presenting the paper Poseidon Phase from Depth for Driver Pose Estimation. So um, imagine you are driving your car, yeah, uh, hopefully a Ferrari, and uh, during your trip, something is attracting your attention. So thus, uh, for a while, you are turning your head for a moment, and then imagine that your car is able to detect uh, your lack of attention and also able to alert you. So actually, this is uh, our project. And the problem you are working on is uh, monitoring the driver level attention. And uh, as a first step, uh, here we show the estimation of the head and the shoulder poses. A camera has been placed behind the, the dashboard. And to be able to work also during the night, we prefer to use an infrared depth camera. From the software side, we propose a set of networks uh, which are able to process all the things. The input frames are acquired by the depth sensor and then are fed to the first network for the head pose estimate, for the head localization and uh, to crop the head around the center. Then we have an image preprocessing step which includes the uh, so-called Poseidon and uh, the face from depth network. Both of them are used to um, process the data and to uh, output the angles of the face and the, of the shoulders. The face from depth network is one of the main novelty of the system. The network is intended to recover the gray level appearance of a gray of a face, given its uh, depth uh, map. The network is composed by 15 layers in total, and the output is so realistic that can be directly provided to a system train on native gray level images. These are some a few examples that are greatly converted to the corresponding gray level images by the proposed network. And the comparison with the ground true highlights the network capabilities. Then the uh, original depth image and uh, also the output of the face from depth component and finally, a motion image are fed to the three networks, individually trained and then fused together in order to estimate the final head angles in regression. We have provided some experiments on a public data set called BWI, and the results are very impressive since the mean error is lower than two degrees. And moreover, you can appreciate the performance of the system in comparison with other state-of-the-art methods. In addition to BWI, we also created a new data set called Pandora. Pandora contains uh, very realistic behaviors of distracted people, and as well as a precise annotation of the head and the shoulder poses. And the data set is available for downloading online. Even on this data set, the system show very accurate results, in particular for our task of uh, uh, monitoring the level of tension. The models of all the networks have been reduced as shallow as possible in order to meet real-time performances, also on embedded devices. Uh, so the video currently running is showing the system output on a real in-car setup. You can see on the left the output of the system, and on the right the three inputs of the networks, so the face on depth, the face gray, and finally the motion image. Okay, thank you very much for your attention and see you at the post number 16.